finally we reached our, our place of our destination in Kazakhstan, it was late fall. So we left in July, Odessa left. So it took us three months, three, four months to get there. So my father, right away, he was, he went back to the front lines and we stayed there. So we lived, my mom, myself, my, my mother's younger sister, Clara, she was 28. Not even 28 and 41. She was born in 1914, so she's 27. And she was a newly married, young, beautiful lady to a wonderful young man. He was drafted, and he was killed in the first days of war. He, she, became, she became a widow. So she was with us and my grandparents, my, my grandfather and my grandmother, my mother's parents. And we started over there, you know. It was... It was not easy. I contracted all kind of childhood diseases, just name it. Plus, I even was able to contract malaria. I, I had malaria. Because, you know, I had to, the, the sewage system was interesting over there. There were like ditches of dirty water running along the streets. And next to the place where we lived, there was a, uh, there was a ditch with this dirty water, and there were some bushes, and I decided to jump over. <laughs> and there were some, some mosquitoes, mm -hmm. and I got sick, and I remember how sick I was, and it was summertime. And I had fever, I think, and it was, I was uh, hot outside, and my mother and my grandmother, they put all, all blankets, which there, was, there were, on top of me, and I was still you know, shivering, shivering. I was shivering. And uh, so, and I don't know how I survived, to tell you the truth, because people are still dying of, of malaria today with all the advances in treatment. Yeah. So, and there was, and I remember when I was sick with malaria, I remember my mom brought me two apples. This place where we lived in Kazakhstan, it was close to, uh, the, the capital of Kazakhstan, which it was called Almata. Almata, in translation, is being called the father of apples. So there was a lot of beautiful, beautiful, all sorts of apples. And my mom brought me two apples, and there was the size, size of a newborn head, this big. And I still remember the taste and the smell and, and how they looked like, you know. It was, it was beautiful.